And is, is there a certain point at which it's too late to apply? In which case you would say to folks, you're better off just waiting till the next cycle? I mean, traditionally, back in the day, you were taking the LSAT in December, you're still okay, right? You were taking the LSAT in the first week of December, you got the score pretty much at the end of December, beginning of January, you were still okay. Now, obviously, that's changed into January, so maybe the target of the whole school cycle has moved. Since there is no test date in December, now there was in January, maybe schools are becoming a little bit more flexible. Personally, I tell my clients, if you plan to take the LSAT in January, you almost forget about getting in because by February, the classes are going to be full. And if you're already kind of like an in-between, on-the-fence candidate, I would really say it's not going to happen. And that's where you kind of, as you just alluded to, you might as well just kind of hold on. Don't take the January test date. If you're planning to take it, don't take it and just take it in like a later date, like March or June, study for it properly, go through the motions, use Steve's stuff, all the gamut of all the stuff that you guys have out there, all the optionality, and then get a solid score in June and then start writing your application over the summer and get it out as soon as possible in September. I, for example, took two years out before I went into law school. So I graduated at 22 from UCLA and I took two years before I matriculated to UC Berkeley uh, Law School uh, when I was 24. I still graduated when I was 29 because I also took a year out to do a master's in the middle of it, and I was fine. It wasn't the end of the world. Thanks for tuning into the show. Please subscribe if you haven't done so already to be notified of new episodes as I release them. And feel free to reach out if you need anything at all as you move forward with your prep. I'm happy to help however I can. In the meantime, I wish you all the best and take care.